This question was asked in the Kate Physics paper 2020. This is a numerical answer type question having one mark. The topic of the question is electromagnetic theory. The question is a conducting sphere of radius 1 meter is placed in air. The maximum number of electrons that can be put on the sphere to avoid electrical breakdown is about 7 times 10 to the power n where n is an integer. The value of n is, so basically we have to find the value of integer n. In this question we have to assume breakdown electric field strength in air is mod of E vector equals to 3 times 10 to the power 6 volt per meter. Permittivity of free space is epsilon naught equals to 8.85 times 10 to the power minus 12 farad per meter and electronic charge E equals to 1.6 times 10 to the power minus 19 coulomb. Let us see how to solve this problem. It is given in the question that a conducting sphere of radius capital R equals to 1 meter is placed in air. The breakdown electric field in air is mod of E vector equals to 3 times 10 to the power 6 volt per meter. The permittivity in the vacuum if so not is 8.85 10 to the power minus 12 farad per meter and the electronic charge is 1.6 times 10 to the power minus 19 coulomb. Now we know the electric field on the surface of a conductor is given by E equals to sigma by epsilon naught, where sigma equals to charge density on the conductor surface. Now if N is the number of electrons on the surface of conductor, then sigma is given by N times E divided by 4 pi R square. So this is the surface area of the uh, conducting sphere. Hence, the electric field on the surface is Ne divided by 4 pi r square times epsilon naught. To avoid the breakdown, the maximum number of electrons that can be put on the sphere is N equals to 7 into 10 to the power N. Here we have to find the N and the corresponding breakdown electric field mod of E that is given in the question is 3 times 10 to the power 6 volt per meter. So we will put all the values in this equation. So our maximum value of E is 3 times 10 to the power 6 that is equal to n times E. So 7 into 10 to the power n times 1.6 times 10 to the power minus 19 divided by 4 pi r square epsilon naught. So 4 pi times 1 square because r equals to 1, the radius equals to 1 times the permittivity in vacuum that is 8.85 times 10 to the power minus 12. So we have 10 to the power n equals to 3 times 10 to the power 6 times 4 pi times 1 square times 8.85 times 10 to the power minus 12 divided by 7 times 1.6 times 10 to the power minus 19. If we calculate this, we will get approximately 10 to the power n equals to 3 times 10 to the power 14. So n equals to log of 3 times 10 to the power 14. This will give approximately 14.47. So the value of n in the integer form is 14. Although the value uh, must lie in between 14 to 15. If you get the answer 14 or 15, that is also correct. So, according to our solution, the maximum number of electrons that can be put on the sphere to avoid electrical breakdown is about 7 times 10 to the power 14. So, the n value is here 14. 